Hi, I'm here with Bohr Peterson from Corvo. And Bohr is going to tell us a little bit about a uh, front end module that Corvo has set up behind us. Bohr, what do we got here? That's right. Well, this is actually the, the world's first 39 gigahertz front end module that integrates a PA, LNA, and switch all into a very small package. So it's a gallium nitride technology, which means we can make very high power. This is a two watt saturated PA and very low noise figure, less than 4.2 dB in this tiny package that allows folks to integrate it into a phased array technology needed for 5G millimeter wave. Ah, that's pretty interesting technology. And I understand that uh, you got a little demo set up behind us here. We do. Well, Keysight's been helping us because this device really has a common antenna port and a receive port and a transmit port. And so you need a special test setup in order to test it easily as we start to bring this product to high volume production. Now I'm here with Sam Cassano from Keysight, and Sam's going to take us through a little test of this Corvo chip. Sam, uh, take it away. Thank you. So I'm showing PNA with test set that is dedicated for beam former IC testing that can measure uh, multiple devices like this. And also, this multiple device has different direction to make linear uh, characteristics measurement. So for example, if this, if this has TX measurement in this direction and RX um, direction in this direction, you have to switch the connection because port one can only have two-tone signal from here and also our noise figure receiver is only available at port two. So with this test set, you can effectively flip the direction of the measurement so that you don't need to disconnect every time to make this kind of uh, device measurement. Especially in the 5G scenario, you will have multiple devices like one input and multiple output. So this uh, test set can be expandable for the multi-port device like up to one by eight so that you can uh, make one by eight measurement uh, very effectively. Sam, can you take us through the uh, screen displays of what we're looking at? Sure. So what we are measuring here is S parameter P1DB and output IP3 and IMD for TX path. And in this case, we are measuring this direction to make all of this measurement. And also, if I switch to the RX mode, we are measuring S parameter IP3 and two-tone measurement and also noise figure measurement. And in fact, this measurement is this direction to make all of this measurement and we are effectively flipping the signal direction inside of this test box. It's interesting, thank you. Thank you. Well, that's interesting technology. Where can people go to get more information about it? Well, they can visit the Corvo.com website because this is a release product and all the data sheet material has been already on the website. Okay, great.